Hey y'all, welcome to a day at the bank. Mrs. Dremont, the owner of this bank, appointed me, Smack Smarts, into helping same business because a lot of people are struggling. We're $3,000 short of paying up what we owe, and we don't have enough. We just don't have enough money for other people's accounts. The evil banker down the street, he wants to buy us and become a monopoly. We cannot let that happen. The evil banker, he does a lot of evil stuff. He says notes like. We will buy your bank and kill your employees. Hmm. He's evil. Did you hear about all the evil stuff that he's done? Maybe I should give a note to my assistant, Chester. Hey, Chester, take a note. Take a note. Hmm. There. Chester took a note. Took a beautiful note. Now, what can we do to get more people here? Maybe we have a king clad woman to give car washes if people will come and give us $40. Oh, here's a guy with a gun. Um, um, you need to drop that gun right now. Drop the gun. Don't point at me. Good boy now. Now go go back where you came from. That's a good boy. See, I'm a very persuasive manager. Hmm. Maybe, maybe first I'll count my money. See, how much money do I have on me in addition to what the bank I see is? 100, 200, 300, 400. We'll give that to 400. Hmm. I think I must count them. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. Wow, well, that's, that's a lot of money, okay. Now I'll count back, right? 100, 200, 300, 400. Or... I can't have the evil banker take over. What's the vice of plan? I mean, he's, he's pure evil. He bombs orphanages, he kidnaps babies and eats them, he blows up bridges, he sets fire to, to buses, he, he robs banks so he can stay ahead of us, he, he stops at low class department stores. He he shoots he gun while having braces. Wait a minute. He robs banks. I guess me an idea. I'll just rob the place. Don't have a gun, but I'll, I'll disguise myself. I get past the people who are pointing guns at the people from coming in here, but I throw on this mask, he won't recognize me. Buy me a gun. I'll get ready and uh, some good yeah. What a nightmare. Uh, so never put that bag over my head. Uh, no oxen, you know. They might still alive. Hmm. So what was it gonna do? Oh yeah. Okay. Ah. That's that couple I told you about. They get married at the bank. Well. Hmm. How have the running people paid made up? What was that, Chester? Uh -huh. Huh. Got another note. It says you got 36 minutes left to, to, to get your money, or the evil banker wins. Oh wow! This means war, of course. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Hmm. Maybe the the cannon will come too late. What's that? Uh, My sister Chester gave me a note. This is another one thing in the note. It says, hmm, that the order for a cannon went through, but we got to wait 10 years for it to be delivered. Why, well, an order of piano, just have a piano, drop it on the evil banker from above. You, you do that, right, Chester? Fine, fine, fine. Hmm. So now, I know, maybe I could sell some stuff and get enough money. Yeah, I can. I can sell my teeth, I can sell some blood, I can sell a kidney or two. Hmm. Okay, how many go sell the kidney? Well, all is well, there's in Israel. The bank is saved, the evil banker was stopped, the, the order for piano came early, and so they dropped it because it just barely missed him. I'd be, I, me, me and the people, me and his people who are out front pointing guns at people, we just beat the crap out of the evil banker, he's arrested now, life is good, I fired my assistant Chester, he was useless, that, that couple, well, that, that they got married, that, that they got divorced, hmm, not as romantic as I thought, this has been a day at the bank.